So this is just a quick demonstration of some of the new features that are in the uh, preview program update for the Xbox One. Um, well, this is actually, I'm streaming this to my uh, PC. So this is another new thing that I found out that you can do now, which is uh, not only you can you stream your gameplay footage to your uh, Windows 10 PC and record it, but they also now allow you to record your voice so that you can do commentary and walkthroughs, you know, without having to have expensive recording equipment and that type of thing. This is pretty cool. Um, another thing um, that you can now do uh, with the update is they added Cortana. So before, where you would have to use the Xbox prompt, like if you wanted to turn your Xbox on, you'd say Xbox on or Xbox go home, you know, stuff like that, you now use the Cortana prompt. And you know, it's still a work in progress, it's definitely in need of some improvement. But one of the things that I like is that you can send text messages through her so when you're playing a game you don't have to you know take your focus off of the game you can just use her um she kind of struggles with names that have like numbers in them um but again they're still working on it so hopefully by the time this is out for everyone they'll have fixed that but i'm gonna see if i can <clears throat> get her to send a message to somebody right now that doesn't have numbers in their name. Hey Cortana, send a message. Sure. Who's the text going to? Mary Solitary. Text Mary Solitary. What would you like to say? Hey, I'm talking to you through the Xbox One. Text Mary Solitary. Hey, I'm talking to you through the Xbox One. Send it, add more, or try again. Send it. I've sent that. So, for some reason, like, my game just froze. I've never had that happen. I don't know if it's because I'm playing a 360 game right now on the Xbox One or not. Um, let me go and try sending a message while I'm playing one of the Xbox One games. Hey Cortana, go to My Games and Apps. I'll look for that in the store. Yeah, see this is another bug, like, she wants to go to the store rather than just go where, you're, where you want her to. But let's see. Another thing I like is that you can now sort your um, games by letter, title, the date last played, um, the size. You can have small tiles, medium size, large size, so that's nice. Hey Cortana! Go to Plants vs. Zombies Garden Warfare 2. I know a lot of people don't like the fact that you have to say the Hey Cortana to get her to do anything. I don't know if that's something they're going to keep or, or what. It doesn't bother me, but I can see how <laughs> that can get annoying. You know, if you have to say that every single time right. you wanted to do something. And she's also right now pretty slow compared to when you were just able to just say Xbox, do this or do that. So hopefully it won't take that long to, for this to boot up. 
I also sort of revamped the store, but I never used it really before, so I don't really notice anything that's different in it. Um, other than that, I don't think they really did too much else that's new. I know they are supposed to do another update later in the year, um, so I don't know what else they're going to revamp, but... And I'm streaming this on the highest possible quality, and because this is an online multiplayer game, and I'm connected wirelessly on both ends, I'm probably going to need to either adjust this down, because I'm probably going to get some serious lag, but well, you know what, I, I won't even start a game. I really just wanted to see if I can send another message without this game freezing up on me so much. Hey Cortana, send a message. Who's the text going to? Mac Jolie. Text Majoli. What's your message? Hi, I'm playing Plants vs. Zombies. Okay, I'll text Majoli. Hi, I'm playing Plants vs. Zombies. Send it, add more, or try again. Cancel. Message canceled. Sorry okay. about that. I didn't hear anything. Okay, so as you can see, this game didn't freeze up, so I, it's probably a bug I need to report, <laughs> and I'll probably test out a few more Xbox 360 games to see if freezing while you're streaming and using Cortana is just something that's happening. But anyway, this is just a little, like I said, demonstration of what's happening with the update now. So thanks for watching.